Hello everybody. Uh, I'm doing my first video. Just be a little patient. Uh, speculation, investment. Uh, pretty much comics are just gonna go up, and maybe one or two that I just dig the covers. Uh, so let's start digging in here. What do we got? Uh, all right, first box here. Let's dig in here. Um, also, too, a lot of these boxes. You want to make sure you always want to look to make sure that uh, UPS or somebody didn't poke a hole and look into these boxes because a lot of times they do that. So you always want to be careful on that. And also you want to make the right tools to open them too so you don't cut into them. All right. It's an Iron Man. I see that. And we got... Ugh. This guy really... <laughs> he really uh, wrapped it good. Ah! Finally, Invincible Iron Man 54 and an 8.0. Beautiful coloring on this. Uh, I love it. We got Submariner. He's hot as anything. Uh, supposedly, uh, one of the Black Panther team said there was some type of quake uh, in Atlantis. And so supposedly, maybe in the next uh, MCU film, Submariner's going to pop up. Hopefully. This guy's a stud. Uh, on this issue of 54, we got the first appearance of Moon Dragon. That's a big deal. Um, I'm pretty, correct me if I'm wrong, she might be on the the new Guardians of the Galaxy team, maybe. Uh, also, we got Heather, Mc, Heather McDouglas as Madame McEvil. Madame McEvil. Wow. Real original, that name. <laughs> and then, of course, Iron Man versus Submariner. You can't beat that. Booyah. Uh, next one. Also, on this Iron Man 54, uh, you got to be careful, too, on your resources because cover price, uh, cover price website had an average at $147 um, and a 9.8. Uh, no. Uh, I'm sorry. In an 8.0, the average price was uh, 147 um, in eight five, it was two hundred forty, and the seven five was one hundred thirty. And the average last year in eight oh, eighty bucks. Next one. Let's see. Anybody poke any holes in this? No. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh. This is interesting wrapping. I've never seen this kind before. Anybody ever see this kind of wrapping before? I've never really seen this. Kind of good. Very safe. Hopefully, I don't think you're going to have any cracked cases. Oh, yeah. So, as you know, uh, what do we got? In the Disney Plus channel, Son of Satan and Hellstrom. So, Damien Hellstrom, number one. I will buy these all day long. Uh, dig the cover. Uh, dig the scenery. Especially the parchment paper cover. It's pretty cool with the red ink. I really dig it. Uh, on these, uh, on Hellstrom... So 9.8 on the websites, they're saying uh, they usually go for like 30 bucks. Raw, two bucks. <laughs> uh, they didn't have any sales on a 9.8. And another website had the average price for a 9.8, 25 bucks last year. I wish I bought a thousand, a thousand of them. <laughs> uh, next, uh, next one. No holes, nobody was peeking through it. Oh, 
Let's go. Oh, Jesus. I hate peanuts. Anybody else hate peanuts? I hate peanuts. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, but I like it when they wrap it in the, in the second box. I like it when they wrap it in the second box. This is, this is a different way of packaging something. What is this? <laughs> a big jumbled mess. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that Sub Zayn and Damien Hellstrom. I think it's very overdue, this whole voodoo magic. Uh, Doctor Strange, Modrid uh, type characters. They need to come out. They need to come out. MCU is, I think, a little behind on that. Ooh, here we go. Ah, another one that's, uh, I love this cover. Ghost Rider. Uh, not a big ticket item, but just an iconic cover. Uh, I think it'll definitely rise in value. Um, I'm loving Ghost Rider. Uh, on this one, the websites had the had a nine eight on an average of highest no a nine eight the highest was one hundred twenty five. Another website raw three hundred fifty average nine eight sixty that's wrong. And also last year average nine eight was seventy. So this has nothing but I think room to go up. Uh, next one. Yeah, I got a few. <laughs> so let's see here. Oh, my box fell. Another one. We got another. Uh, this one's Blaze number one. It's got a little bit of, uh, if you can see it, it's got a little bit of that, uh, not lenticular, but what do they do when they put that shiny stuff on there? Uh, shiny stuff. I dig it. <laughs> uh, this is Ghost Rider Appearance Embossed Silver. That's it. That's the comic technical term embossed silver once again i think this is going to be another comic that's going to jump way up when the whole disney plus blades and the same comes up um the websites had this at a 98 average 35 raw a dollar uh, and they actually had no sales for 98 these these websites need to you know catch up it went dark. I don't know why. Alright, next one here. This is another very professionally packaged comic. <laughs> I'd like to hear um, some of your comments too on if you think the MCU is behind on all of all the characters that are involved in magic and voodoo and things like that demons, witches, you know I know, you know, right off the bat, I'm thinking Scarlet Witch, but eh, I'd still like a little bit more uh, creepy horror, horror flavor to it instead of superhero flavor to it. Ah, so I got this cover strictly, it's just cool as hell. Uh, I've been looking for really cool Joker covers for the Joker movie, and I'm going to be buying... 
a lot of these. I think this is an iconic cover, um, or will be. This is very nice. There we go. I love this cover. This is just amazing. I could just see the new Joker movie having a scene where he's looking just like that. Definitely beauty. Um, so on the comic websites, they got this one. Um, so the average they're saying is 150, raw 10 bucks. Uh, <laughs> Go collect. When I tried to look it up, they had the numbers out of order. <laughs> and last year, fifty dollars. Now they're going for 150. Last year, fifty. I still say it's going to go up. My guy's telling me I got 15 minutes left. <laughs> so what, so let's pause it. What does that mean? 